High in the Andes, the Inca didn't rely on steel or concrete. They built suspension bridges from braided grass across vast canyon gaps, connecting remote mountain villages and controlling an empire of thousands of kilometers of road. Think of rope bridge spans up to 200 feet, hand-woven by local communities, tested by loaded llamas and soldiers, and rebuilt every year. These tensile marvels weren't temporary, they were lifelines. Instead of stone arches, the Inca used flexibility. Planks woven and lashed, cables of ichu grass twisted into ropes strong enough to hold people, beasts, and goods. When Spanish conquistadors arrived in the 1500s, they were astonished. In a land of rock and cliff, the empire spanned with living bridges that grew weaker with neglect, stronger with maintenance. What's the twist? By the time modern engineering arrived, many of these bridges had vanished, their memory fading. Yet the technique still survives in a few local communities. It's a technology that seems simple, yet solved one of the hardest problems of terrain and empire. So next time you cross a canyon on steel or concrete, remember, somewhere above you once swung a rope bridge of grass, holding one of the greatest empires in human history.